Their target is heading for the Golden Gate Bridge. May 1937. With the bridge at last completed, the long-awaited day arrives. Joseph Strauss proudly pronounces his bridge open to the world. The Golden Gate's the world's most famous bridge has been under constant attack from nature's destructive forces. Of all the forces of nature that San Francisco's structures face, earthquake is the ultimate destroyer. But here again, the elements rear their ugly head. Disaster strikes, fierce winds bend its towers. Sea fog, laden with corrosive salt, eats away at its massive metal heart. The prediction is there is less than 35 years to save San Francisco's most beloved landmark. In San Francisco, it's happened before, and it's going to happen again. Right now, the city and its famous bridge are staring down the barrel of the gun. For about three months of the year, the Golden Gate has its own private weather nightmare. The corrosion of the steel by salty fog is slowly, silently killing the bridge. Treacherous currents batter its foundation. The winds at the entrance to the bay are far too menacing. The cold, damp fog eats metal and creates evil working conditions. And the raging waters racing through the gate are way too wide to build a structure in. Deep inside the rock, an unimaginable force is building. When the pressure gets too much, the earth moves. With a tireless team relentlessly replacing the cracking concrete and rusting iron, the bridge stays one step ahead. To stand any chance of survival, the steel and concrete of the 70-year-old superstructure is undergoing a major overhaul. It's this clash that creates an even more destructive element than the wind. What they don't know is that a destructive force far greater is building in the ground beneath their feet, and it threatens the very existence of the bridge. For the 70-year-old Golden Gate Bridge, it's very bad news. There is no warning. It's all over in 40 terrifying seconds. People are killed in their sleep. Even for seasoned Californians, the intensity was beyond experience. So how can a retrofit, unlike anything done on a suspension bridge before, save the Golden Gate from the next big one? The next stage of this supreme construction achievement is to push the boundaries of engineering, result in a tragic series of deaths, that in order to stay standing, the Golden Gate Bridge urgently needs a serious upgrade. So with all these destructive elements stacked up against you, why on earth build a bridge? But after everything it's been through, it remains the Golden Gate, the most famous, most admired bridge in the world. But the worst is still to come.